connected regiments to Ukraine. Paratroopers from the 173rd Airborne Brigade will train 900 soldiers from Ukraine's National Guard in three rotations over the next six months. The training will include everything from medical care and casualty evacuation to how to move as part of a small military unit and how to better shoot using the kind of weapons already used by the Ukrainian forces. Here they're doing a basic marksmanship exercise. The US troops would usually use a rifle like the M4 for an exercise like this, but here they're using an AK-74, which is a weapon that the Ukrainians are much more familiar with. Many of the National Guard units began as volunteer groups with little or no combat experience, but most of the Guardsmen here have spent time on the battlefield in eastern Ukraine, and the US trainers say they have confidence in their skill level. We really started training yesterday, uh, and we kicked it off with classes, uh, basic weapon training, uh, sight picture focusing on breathing and trigger squeeze, and the uh, Ukrainian forces, the Jaguar company partnered with us, uh, knew exactly what we were talking about right from the beginning, and we were able to get out here and start training uh, right away with no issues. All right, shooter, ready? Ready. Send it. Левый стрелок на 300 метров огонь. Good hit. Good hit. Kiev hopes the operation, which has sparked an angry reaction from Moscow, will improve the fighting capabilities of its irregular troops before they head back to the conflict zone. There you go, target. A ceasefire between Ukraine and the pro-Russian separatists is technically still in place, but violence and violations are reported almost daily, and it's unclear how long the truce will hold. Kate Parkinson, CCTV in Western Ukraine.